We got so many creative ideas, we don't know which one we're working on. What is the most breaks are only a break on your wallet. <laughs> this is a cannabis kind of 101 vibe, and we're to we're gonna talk about how I roll. Accessories lines. I keep, I heard the caps. Okay. Um. Anyway, <laughs> we right now can't afford to open a grow. Let's just get real. It's very, I don't know, systematically difficult to become a part of the legal industry because of racism and garbage. Capitalism bad. Anyway, uh, um, free market good. So what is yeah, 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 that's right. So what is, why do we have so many ashtrays so on this table? we understand that a sesh is more than a sesh. Enjoying cannabis is about, sometimes it's coping, it's ritual, and so we have created a line, I'm gonna say that very, very loosely, a line of accessory items that you can partner with your sesh that we truly love, because I do not like to promote things that I do not like. Anyway, so these are vintage ashtrays that I have, um, me and my partner Josh, who's also one of our writers, have gone around to estate sales and pick in to try to find these. This thing is so heavy, and we just have found some of the coolest antique ashtrays. So these will be available soon. Oh, sorry, soon on our shop as Sam, well at, at events. This, this one here is just so camp, don't you think? Oh my God, don't say it like that. He got it's, coached this morning. Yeah, I was trying to just learn. The concept of camp is very nuanced, and neither of you understand it. I, do I don't even try to. Okay, I, do I don't even try to. Listen, look at this I've beautiful been ashtray. I'm actually, I'm burning one of our incense that we are prototyping these extra large incense pyramids. They are made out of sawdust from his family's workshop, like pit pine, Salt. cedar, a sawmill, and uh, we mix different herbs. Like this one has cinnamon and honey. And the down the downside to a video format is they cannot smell that right now. Oh my gosh. And it it literally like this one cone is filling the entire space. <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah, it's great. I'm obsessed. But also this I found this. I found I found this and I have it in my house and I can't <laughs> for someone to love it. Some little cute uh, crystal. I try to find real like yeah. crystal items. Anyway, these are some of the accessories as well as this amazing candle that my partner made uh, this double wick, all the vintage items that we can we sell at our table. Um, yeah, uh, of course, do you want to talk about the journal? Yes. Pastor? We believe that cannabis is sacred. It's a spiritual experience that was put here to help us heal. Uh, and so Sam wrote a mindful use journal. Uh, there's nothing like this. There's nothing like this. On the market. Um, this is what your actual work, uh, like your experience note-taking journey will look like. Uh, we have changed it. This it's a little smaller now. Well, a little smaller. There's been a little bit of design change um, in but stuff same, like this. But, but generally the general same idea. Same idea. Um, so you're going to go through and you're going to be very mindful about what you're feeling, what you're smelling, how you're being... Uh, changed by the experience, you're going to write down any mantras you have going on currently that you want to speak over yourself. There are also some um, like prompts. There's activities. Yeah, they're like uh, sprinkled throughout. Um, yeah, there's nothing like this on the market and I think you're going to have a really good time uh, with it. And this is my favorite part, is that it allows us to create a ritual. We came from a spiritual background. Uh, we all went to the same Bible college, and like the sacred space was important to us, each of us in our own ways. And in a lot of ways, we kind of lost it. Yep. Uh, and this is a way that we get to bring that sacred space back. Yes, absolutely. And the thing is, is that a lot of people are using cannabis to cope with intense pain, trauma, physical pain, emotional pain. Yep. And so, if you're able to not only cope but also look in, like our, our, our company model is look in, let go, light up. 
with this, look in and, and notice how you're feeling. Be mindful of your body. There's so many studies to say that just a little bit of mindfulness is like life changing to the health of your brain, um, your ability for to have resilience, and then letting go to say, you know what, maybe I'm not feeling perfect like someone on social media, but I'm letting go of that expectation and saying I accept myself as I am, and then lighting up, which is moving forward to experience coping, and then also like to celebrate that you're you're part of the human experience, and it's passing before us, and yes, we exist on a screen, we are part of the problem, but I hope when you come to this space, we remind you of the important things that exist out there with grass. But also, world. I mean, to that point, Sam, they have an opportunity to join us live. Yes, we have events. We want to be friends. We want to be Moonstone buddies. 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 And so you can sign up for our uh, community zine, which is just a newsletter that goes out um, every other Frequently. week. Frequently. Uh, at least once a month, up to at most once a week. You will receive it at times that you won't feel bombarded. But you know what? It's important when it goes out. <laughs> it's important. And the quality. And the quality. You know, it's all right. It's fine. But subscribe to this YouTube channel. Comment down below. Ask us anything. Reach out to us on Instagram. Before we go, before we do all that, before we go, where can the, if they are watching right now, where can they get these products? If they see this and they want it. If they want it, they're going to have to come to an event for these items or follow us for when the tick, uh, for when our Instagram shop or TikTok shop goes live. We're having problems with Instagram. Working on it, but it and if you if you subscribe to the zine, uh, it, it, I, with the frequency, whatever. But uh, like all of our links, all the way to connect with us, all of the events, all of the products, everything is highlighted in the zine. We do some uh, advocacy writing. We talk about stuff happening in the news. Yes, uh, all come, sorts of content. Come see us in person and give high fives. We do like high fives. We're not hugs. Don't touch me. Well, if, if some of us, it just depends. You know, it might be weird. Ask first. Subscribe to the channel. <laughs>